Immigration to Ireland for business. A business visa permits you to work in Ireland for up to 14 days, provided the purpose of your visit is to engage in business-related activities. British nationals then are in a certain uh, special category. They can travel freely to Ireland without the need for a visa. This is as a result of the common travel area between the UK and Ireland. British and Irish citizens can live and work in each other's countries without the need for a visa or permit. The common travel area arrangement continues despite the exit of the UK from the European Union. EEA nationals do not need a visa or permit to carry on business in Ireland. Nationals from certain countries are visa exempt, that is, they do not need a visa for short visits to Ireland, including business visits. Business visitors will need documentation which sets out the purpose of the visit, evidence of sufficient funds and a letter of invitation from an Irish business contact. Short stay business visas. Short stay visas are called C visas. A short stay C visa allows you to travel and stay in Ireland for up to 90 days for activities related to your job including meetings, negotiate or sign contracts, work for 14 days or less. Your work must start and end within a single 14 day period. You cannot work more than once during the 90 day period. A C visa permission can be extended if there is an unexpected change in your circumstances since you entered Ireland. The temporary extension can be for up to 90 days. Situations which might give rise to this extension include your inability to travel for medical reasons and or there must be a change in your circumstances since you entered Ireland. The application can be made to the Immigration Service Delivery Service or your local immigration office. A van der Els visa arises from an ECJ 1994 decision in the van der Els case. It is based on the EU principle of freedom to provide services within the EU. It allows for temporary cross-border posting of employees without the need for a work permit. A non-EEA national who is lawfully resident and employed in another EU country may be able to work in Ireland for that employer or on, a, or on a temporary basis without the need for a work permit. You will not be permitted to work other than for the work for which you are approved and you cannot access public funds. There is a British-Irish visa scheme which allows certain individuals to travel to and around Ireland and the UK, the common travel area, on a single visa for short stays only. A single entry British-Irish visa scheme endorsed visa means a single entry to the common travel area. You can also get a multiple entry visa which allows you to visit as many times as you like within the permitted stay period. This will be stamped on your passport when you first arrive in Ireland. A visa waiver program. The short stay visa waiver program allows nationals of certain countries to travel to Ireland without the need to obtain an Irish visa, provided they have entered the UK on foot of certain UK short stay visas. In order to avail of the program, you must have landed and gained lawful entry to the UK on foot of your current UK visa prior to coming to Ireland. This program is not reciprocal, however. You cannot enter the UK on foot of an Irish visa if you are a visa-required national under EUK law. There's a start-up entrepreneur program, the STEP program. It allows an entrepreneur to apply for permission to establish a business and reside in Ireland on a full-time basis. You may apply for a STEP if you are a person of good character, have no criminal convictions, have €50,000 funding, have an innovative business proposal. The types of business which are desirable include those in areas of high potential growth. Businesses in retail, catering and personal services are not suitable for this scheme. The purpose of this programme is to allow non-EEA nationals and their families to start a high potential business in Ireland and to obtain residency status in Ireland. High Potential Startup HPSU. The type of startup within the STEP programme must be a startup which is introducing a new or innovative product or service to international markets. It should be capable of creating 10 jobs in Ireland and generating sales of 1 million in sales within three years of starting up, 
be headquartered and controlled in Ireland, be led by an experienced management team and have funding of at least €50,000 for their business proposal. A comprehensive business plan will be needed and proof of the funds of €50,000 having been transferred to a financial institution which is regulated by the Central Bank of Ireland evidence of good character from the police authorities of each country in which you've resided for more than six months during the previous 10 years and audit accounts for an existing business that is relocating to Ireland. I hope you find this video useful. There is plenty more information about immigration law on my website businessandlegal.ie. If you find the video useful, I'd appreciate if you gave it the thumbs up down below if you're watching on YouTube. And if you are listening to the podcast, the Irish Law and Small Business podcast, then you should consider uh, following or uh, subscribing or giving a decent review to my podcast on either iTunes or Spotify or wherever you might listen to your podcasts. Thanks a lot.